the, you know, I thought overall it was a good game for us to be able to get a ton of minutes and a ton of reps. We've talked at length about how young we are and, and the amount of reps that these guys got to get to get up to speed. You can't rush experience, um, but they've got to get it and ascertain it and be able to uh, improve each night. I saw a lot of good things out of uh, all of them across the board, but a ton of teachable moments. Uh, that we'll go back and work on in, the, in our short turnaround. We leave tomorrow morning at 6 to get on the bus to go to TCU, who who uh, just had a really good win over Washington State out of the Pac-12 conference uh, and is undefeated at 2-0. and So uh, we get at it pretty quickly uh, on Thursday night, so it'll be a good test for us. Uh, just for starter, Coach, um, it's always good to get a win in that first game, right? Now, I'm sure you guys are happy, you know, putting all that work over the offseason and come on and get immediate results. It was. It was good to see all these guys be able to get their feet wet, to be able to, to, to get experience. I think we saw a lot of nerves. I think we saw a lot of jitters, which was great to be able to play this first one at home. Uh, I give a lot of credit to Pensacola Christian. They played very physical. Uh, they're a very, very well coached team. Uh, it was a great game for us uh, to open up with. I also got to give credit to our students. Uh, they were amazing. Uh, our, our first year experience office, our, our dorm, uh, our st uh, student uh, involvement and leadership office was amazing. We had an incredible student crowd tonight, and great turnout, and a great first night crowd that hopefully we can build on. But uh, it was a good payoff, a good start for us to, to be able to move forward and get into a big game Thursday. Mm -hmm. and, uh, amazing thing for tonight, uh, 27 turnovers, the pressure defense yeah. you guys were inserting. Uh, had a lot of results that allowed out easy buckets for you guys. How important was that in this game? It was important for us to be able to, you know, we went on some stretches where we didn't score. Uh, I think we we made some experience errors, uh, and I think it was important for us to get some turnovers that led to easy buckets in order to get keep the momentum going and keep growing the lead uh, and keep moving it forward. So I was really excited about that. Um, but it was it was good for us to be able to get in position and play. We've got a ways to go from the defensive end, uh, but I think they're understanding the concepts and I think that they're growing. Uh, and understanding what we need to do. Uh, Kevin Brown came out with scoring nine points in the first half, came right there in that first five minutes of the second half and scored nine points. Seemed to kind of really uh, get comfortable in his role in the offense and the defense. Can you talk about just his first game and what did you see from him? It was really important, you know, when you look at the big picture of our team, having a guy like Kevin, uh, when everybody might have been a little nervous at right there off the start in that first game, he was very steady, he was calm. Uh, he was able to knock down shots. He wasn't at all flustered at the start of each half. Uh, he was a great calming effect for us. Uh, and when you look back, that he just got to start practice, um, full go practice in, in late October uh, after coming off a of knee surgery. He's really uh, probably a little bit ahead of where he probably should be. Uh, and that's a lot to do with uh, credit to him and his work ethic that he's had through there. And our training staff has done a great job with him. Uh, but he was really a, a calming force for us, and we're really uh, pleased with where he was uh, in his game. And also, uh, he decided to go with Trayvon in the first half. I mean, it's been the starting lineup. Is that how you pronounce it, Trayvon? Yeah, Trayvon to the. Yeah, so uh, what exactly did you see from him, and what exactly do you think he's going to bring to that starting unit? Well, he's had a, he's had a great uh, a great summer and a great fall. He's really done a lot of good things for us, and I wanted to get him. Uh, an experience in the start that because he, I don't know whether to start but every game I think it's very competitive uh, and our lineup will probably be very fluid throughout the year based on competition throughout the week uh, but I wanted he had earned it I wanted to give him an opportunity to get out there and try and see how he did right off the bat and it was good to have Terrence who had who's got experience Terrence came off the bench and wasn't shook you know shook he knew what was going to happen so it was good to have uh, uh, somebody that can come we could bring off the bench with experience. Uh, considering the rest of the team was, was basically newcomers. Get on a bus and go to Fort Worth now. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll load up at 6 a.m. and get going uh, tomorrow morning uh, for the big game on, on Thursday. It's a, it'll be a great test for us. They had a good win against Prairie View, uh, opening night for them, and then uh, beat, a, beat a solid Washington State team on uh, last night, beat them pretty, pretty solid. So it's going to be a tough test. Just general comment on this game since I was here earlier. You know, I think it was a good start for us. I think everybody got an opportunity to get their feet wet and see where they were. Uh, we got to play some guys at multiple positions, which I think was good for us. Uh, we saw we've got some glaring improvement areas that we can go, but a lot of that I think is experience-based, that we've got to just get reps and we've just got to get time and just got to keep grinding and moving forward. Uh, but I wasn't uh, disappointed in our effort. Uh, I thought we played good team basketball. I didn't think we took selfish shots. 
Uh, I thought we shared the ball and played uh, like a pretty good unit. I was pretty pleased with where we're at. And th this is a good team. They get along a lot. Uh, there's not a lot of uh, internal stuff. I think they've got a chance that they can keep working uh, to really come February. They'll probably be pretty solid. Thank you, sir. My pleasure.